a Chicago widow is getting hosed. How bad? She's charged the equivalent of six families. CBS2 investigator Brad Edwards scrutinizes the city's inexplicable calculation. My bill is five times what some of my neighbors are paying. Long skeptical of her water bill. Kathy Zook reached out to CBS2 after seeing our series on inexplicable bills getting hosed. They are pulling numbers out of a hat. Some say a hat, some say elsewhere. Zook has an unmetered account. The city estimates those bills based on property size, plumbing fixtures, and a bunch of other gobbledygook. City said, Your current water charge is $449. Your current sewer is $449. I know this. I can read. She asked the city simply, how is that calculated? There's no, no formula, no explanation. We couldn't find an explanation either, so we FOIA'd, sent in a public information request for the city's billing policy. They sent us the municipal code. Problem? The codes... They don't add up. They don't reconcile. They don't match the bill. There's no way to check that these numbers are correct. So? I started gathering my paperwork. Let's backtrack a minute. Her husband, Norbert, died of lung cancer in 2015. And, well... When you're dealing with a life-changing situation like that, the bills would come. I was on autopilot. I'd pay it. I really wasn't paying attention. When she finally looked. In 2009, my annual water bill was $371.48. In 2019, I paid $2,351.18. A 500% increase. Zook dug more. Her neighbor paid 40 bucks a month. To Kathy's nearly 200. What's wrong with this picture? In one year, Kathy paid nearly $2,400. So how's that shake out? Well, in Chicago, a thousand gallons costs three dollars and eighty-one cents. So she paid, and then divided by, and that equals, and times a thousand. That means I went through 590,000 gallons of water in one year. The average household uses 100,000 gallons a year. I'm the only one living in this house. The city's charging her for the equivalent of what six families would use. Again, no meter, no proof. Chicago math. Charging her, again, unmetered, so unmeasured, charging her for nearly 50,000 gallons a month, 1,600 gallons a day, 68 gallons per hour. That's more than a gallon a minute. She tried and couldn't even fill this. I stopped it at one minute, two seconds. Gallon in a minute. Not quite. Not quite. Impossible. Yet by the city's guesstimate, this would mean that this faucet would have to be running constantly, 24 hours a day, to get to that water level. We keep asking the city. Makes a widow wonder if she's one of many getting hosed. Brad Edwards, CBS2 Investigators. We asked the city to explain Zook's bill multiple times two weeks later. No explanation. By the way, Brad's working on another getting hosed case, which took him right to City Hall. They're trying to charge this Vietnam veteran $10,700 for water he's never used. We went up to Department of Finance. They sent us down here. So who do we talk with? The CBS2 investigators are getting the runaround in the case of Vietnam veteran Rodney Andrews. Mr. Andrews' water bill tops 10 grand, even though he has no running water, never has, never used a drop. He can't even live in his home, yet a $10,000 bill. Stay tuned. And to see all of our Emmy Award winning series on Chicago's baffling water bills, go to cbschicago.com slash getting hosed.